Yo, what's up, Play Squad? Welcome back to the channel, XP Kage. Back to you guys another video, and today's video on Shinobi Striker is how to carry your team successfully in red and white battle against three of your friends. And Kaze, Mario, if you guys are watching this, this is no hate. This is just a funny video. This is really funny. They did get some kills on me, and they did beat me before. Uh, but I wasn't treating this as an actual uh, competitive thing. I wasn't trying to uh, really fight them. I wasn't, I wasn't trying to win, all right? Originally, I wasn't trying to win on flag battle because I didn't care. It was three on one. I was, on, I was told they were all three slugs, and my randoms mostly sucked. Uh, so, yeah, it was all fun and games. And yeah, that's what this video is. I'm gonna do some commentary on it because they didn't—they had their mics uh, where they couldn't be shared, so I didn't get the, that stuff. Uh, also, hopefully, I'll be able to be streaming today uh, on Shinobi Striker around 5 p.m. Hopefully, but anyways, I'm about to show you guys what I used in this video and how I carried this team that I was on to victory. And uh, yeah, let's get into it. Alright, first thing we have here is Shiki Shoto, which you can guys get from the Nagato reanimated DLC. And then I have Firestyle Majestic Destroyer Flame, which you can get from the Madara DLC. Uh, Clay Clone Explosion, which you do get from Datara. And Heavenly Conceal, which you get from the uh, Madara DLC as well, which that comes in clutch quite a bit. For the uh, uh, top skill, I have Power and Spades. Bottom skill, I have Clear Mind. And uh, accessory skill, I have Battle Harden. The top skill, Boost and Ninja to Damage. Bottom skill, Reduces Ninja to Cooldown. And uh, the accessory skill, Resets uh, a certain amount of health after you defeat an enemy. And I did not have this equipped. You guys can get this from the item shop. It is not in the item shop at the moment. But I was using the... Uh, uh, flash bomb the smoke flash and uh, that's also from the shop which is also not in the shop at the moment besides that let's get into this video Now here we go, yo. Yeah, this is a pretty good build. Like, like, let me remind you guys though, this is a three on one. Yes, they have one random, and yes, I have three randoms. But these randoms are doo doo water. Their random was probably doo doo water. I don't remember. I uh, <laughs> I'm not really fighting. I'm not really fighting that random. Uh, dang. Uh, dang. I'm gonna let these guys get beat on. These guys are gonna be my, uh, they're gonna be my distraction. I'm gonna pit him. I think that was the, ra I think that was actually the random. Try to be stealthy over here. Pop Shoto. Charge up my majestic destroyer flame. I don't use the crane outfit because I need my sub, you know, with this, you kind of need your sub. Oh, the dude was taken out by a Kieran scroll. Yes, my random did get some kills, but you know, of course, of course they're gonna get some kills. But do you see my kills, my scoreboard? I was even first place, bro. I, ca I carried. I'm carrying. <laughs> but uh, <laughs> dang, this is actually a pretty good build. This is a really interesting build, especially for one of those. Especially if you are a noob and you don't really have no much to do, use this, I guess. <laughs> but uh, yeah, let me hit him with a majestic dang, bro. Dude literally getting hit with Majestic. I'm gonna turn this man into a whole ass fireball himself. <laughs> I'm really surprised they're not coming to try to search me, search for me, and get me. I literally just keep on coming out of nowhere and hitting these guys with Majestics, and I just got hit with Yasuka Beads. And I just popped Shoto, so. Yeah, as soon as I said, I'm surprised they're not coming after me. Yeah. But, uh. <laughs> you see, yeah, I got zero kills and zero deaths right now. But, uh, this match, it, it takes patience. It takes patience and it takes, uh, effort. You gotta have patience. You gotta know when to strike. And, uh, yeah, you gotta know the perfect time to use your jutsus. Even though, sometimes I miss my jutsus. I see my game is lagging a little bit here. 
Uh, Shinobi Striker servers are weird, and I just hit Mario again. Uh, sorry, Mario, that I targeted you the most. I realize I did hit you a lot with fireballs in this match, but, uh, dang, bro. I'm sorry, bro. <laughs> I've literally been targeting him this whole match, and I got hit with Izanami. Mario, bro. I got pitfall by Izanami. Now I'm at 0 and 1. But it's all good. While I'm letting these breadies get beat on and let them be uh, Kaze, Mario, and uh, I think his name is Pan or something like that, or Pat, Pat's uh, punching bags, mostly Mario and Kaze. If you guys don't remember who Kaze and Mario are, these guys are two guys from the old PAO clan that I originally started out on. Uh, my, the first clan I was actually in. And uh, yeah, Kaze and Mario fully got back to Shinobi, and yeah, I was having, yo, I just took out Pat with that Majestic. I apologize. Oh, and Mario got pitfall too. I pitfall Mario with Majestic. Now that's two and one, <clears throat> if I'm not mistaken. Yep, two and one. But uh, I apologize to Pat though too, because he he's an actual Breddy. Uh, we were in one of these matches <laughs> earlier, and dude was like, "I'm glad I'm not on your guys' side. I'm not uh, on the receiving end of your guys' side." Uh, I have another video posting for you guys uh, about beating on <laughs> beating on Breddies or something like that. Another video. Uh, that's uh, I think that's one of the uh, battles where uh, Pat said he's glad he's not on the receiving end of all that uh, of all this stuff. See, pillars always be getting in the way, especially if you're in pit and you t barely touch a tree. That tree in pit can ruin your entire day. And he was putting Izanami. I did target Mario a lot with this, and he got pitfalled again. <laughs> Three and one. And you see, we're down to four and four. You know, they did hold off quite a bit. They did hold off quite a bit. I, I give the, I give them some props. They they are pretty good punching bags. They were the distraction that I needed to, in order to help us attain this dub. As, as I said before, I'm not really trying uh, to win. I was I'm not really trying to win uh, red and white at all because you know I got a lot of scrolls. I really don't need to grind for scrolls. I just play to have fun. And uh, yeah, as you see, I'm just standing here, just chilling and vibing. No one even notices I'm up here. Okay, yeah, I got hit now. And uh, now I'm about to use the Heavenly Conceal Glitch. You guys don't know what the Heavenly Conceal Glitch is. If you stand on the wall and pop Heavenly Concealed, it basically instant kills anyone who was in that circle. It's basically the Shockwave alone kills it kills uh, them. So, yeah. 7-1, I carried the team. GG's, Kaze, and it's me, Mario. And uh, yeah, GG's to everyone in this match. Uh, hope you guys did enjoy. Peace out, Plague Squad. XP Kage, out.